Ross TV. What's up, y'all? This your boy J. Ross hanging out in St. Louis with Miguel Lynette in town, hitting with PJ. Boy, Lynette, you done blown up since last time we hung out. Me too. Boy, you doing some of everything now. How you feel to be like in such a demand now? God, it's just in the blessing business, you know. I'm just grateful. You know, since you last saw me, I was doing um, MD, David Talbert, my husband doesn't know. And since then, um, I've been touring with different artists. I was out in Japan with this artist named I. Just joined PJ's band, so I'm grateful to be a part of this band. It's a lot of fun so far, so I'm enjoying myself. Once again, y'all, we in St. Louis with Lynette. Hammond girl. Hammond girl. Hammond girl, organ player. Hey, Lynette, now, uh, how is it for a female to be an MD of such a large production? Do people take you seriously or do you have to get on them? Um, for the most part, people take me seriously. You know, not only am I a female, but I have a baby face. So, oh, yeah. you, know, <laughs> you know, but for the most part, people respect me in the industry. My name, you know, I'm putting my name out there and more people know about me, the more respect I've been getting. So, so far, so good. So you growing, I know you always have, you wear your uh, emotions on your sleeves, yeah. especially on Facebook. Oh, yeah. You know, so, uh -oh. Uh -oh. So, so last time we talked, what that, what that love life looking like now? Um, it's still the same right now. I've just been so busy touring, you know. I have some friends, <laughs> but <laughs> not like that. Yeah. 30 miles. No, no, but, you know, I've just been so busy touring, you know, but I know. Whoever God has for me is out there, you know. He's got to be a lover of music, though. Oh, yeah. God first, but music. Oh, yeah. Hey, would you recommend this life for uh, other up-and-coming young ladies? Um, if they're serious about it and if they have tough skin. You definitely have to have tough skin in this industry. Well, you mean, hold on, break that down a little bit. Kind of, so, I don't mean, I don't mean scare them, but kind of let them know the realness of what you do. Like, you just have to be able to take, you have to take the good with the bad and the ugly. Not everybody has your best intentions. You know, some people might see you as a piece of meat. You have to be strong enough to resist that. You know, there are temptations. You have to, you have to be your own individual. You know, people are going to compare you to other female musicians, which is fine, but it's, you've got to kind of make your own way, you know, and set your own way. Fortunately, I have a good rep, you know, and I come highly recommended, so I'm really grateful. Oh, yeah. So what was your practice regimen like growing up to be so good? I used to practice three to four times a week. My parents didn't play. My parents didn't play, but I got serious. When I got about 14 or 15 is when I became more serious about, you know, practicing and it's finally paying off so for sure, so I'm grateful. Oh yeah, once again, y'all, we in St. Louis downtown with the Hammond Gay, Lynette, hitting with PJ. Now, uh, talk about how did you uh, come upon this gig? Um, PJ and I have been friends for several years, and he'd been trying to get me on, but because of the, ge the geographics didn't work out. I was the only person living on the West Coast, everyone was based in Atlanta. Right. So it was, you know, it was basically, it just wasn't the right time. Yeah. And finally, a few months ago, you know, he, he called me and was like, Lynette, we're ready for you. And I was ready. I've been ready for years. So <laughs> I'm just grateful. So what's up next for you, Lynette? I'm um, still doing the PJ tour. You know, keep your eyes out. I'm working on an organ trio project soon. Organ so, trio? Organ trio. Me, you... uh, I'm put together a guitar player and a drummer. And it's going to be just me, my organ, and probably doing a little singing too. We'll see. Straight up. Mm -hmm. So this is going to be uh, the Lynette project. Yep. Oh, yeah, that'll work, that'll work. Hey, y'all, but Lynette, uh, graciously always look out for J-Ross TV. We're going to let her bounce, y'all. It's getting kind of late. Uh, J-Ross TV, 10 million strong. We gone. Peace.